Hey everybody, Bob Buskirk here again at Think Computers, and today we're taking a look at another solid state drive. It's from Silicon Power. I don't know if you've heard of them, but they're kind of newer in the US. They're, they're mainly um, more popular overseas, but this is their first SATA 6 gig drive. It's the V30, and let's open it up and check out what's inside. Okay, so taking a look at the packaging, Silicon Power does a nice job. Um, it's open in the front so you can take a look at the drive. Um, some of the features, it's SATA 3, 6 gig, um, lower power consumption, shock resistant, and it comes with a mounting bracket. On the back, it lists some of the specifications. Um, most importantly, the performance, you have a max read up to 550 megabytes a second and max write of uh, 500 megabytes a second. So let's go ahead and open it up. All right, getting it open here. Everything seems nicely packed. You have um, your mounting bracket, which is nice because a lot of cases don't have mounting brackets. Um, a lot of older cases don't have mounting brackets for two and a half inch drive, so that's it's nice that it's included. Um, a lot of companies are moving away from that, but I still like to see it. You have an installation guide, which shouldn't really need to be included, but it's there anyways. You have your mounting screws and the drive itself. Let's go ahead and take a look at the drive. Um, as you can see, there's a sticker on the front that tells you it is the V30 um, SATA 3 drive. On the back, there's nothing. And then you have your typical connections. You have SATA power and the data, SATA data. And um, let's go ahead and open it up. All right, so getting most... Uh, solid state drives open is very simple actually um, it's good to get like a kit like this um, I have this mini screwdriver kit it has a ton of different things so this is perfect for hard drives or a lot of cases and things like that um, things that have weird just like weird hex bolts and small uh, screws this is perfect so remember um, there is a sticker on here so we are gonna avoid the warranty when we open it up here um, but it should be pretty simple four screws that should come out very easily there's one and try not to lose these screws they don't provide extras and they're extremely small and easy to lose so let's not do that If we can find this under the word warranty sticker. So we just voided our warranty, which is typical when we do solid state drives. Now, this comes apart and it's actually upside down. So you can't even see the controller right now. Um, but you see one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight um, memory chips. So let's go ahead and take the entire thing off because we will see the rest of the drive when we do that again four more screws which you don't want to lose again just a reference these are intel memory chips they are the well I don't even want to read that um, they are Intel chips usually when um, you see solid state drives it's usually micron or Intel chips that are used for the most part okay so taking that apart really weird that they have the memory on the back and the controller on the front or back or however you want to call it but it's usually usually see it they're all in one but they just did it a little bit differently so you do have your controller right here this is the sandforce controller the typical sf2281 um 
that's the standard for Sandforce 6 gig drive. So, yeah, guys, this is the Silicon Power um, V30 solid state drive, 60 gigabyte. Um, stay tuned for a review really soon.